All right, so in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use OBS in order to do a vlog. Um, many of my students uh, did one before, but there are some that still may not know, so I'm going to make this video so that everybody understands what I expect them to do. So the first thing that you're going to do uh, is you're going to open up OBS, which is this icon right there. And um, if you already have another scene open, uh, you're going to have to do the following steps anyway. If you have a blank scene, uh, this is kind of what it looks like. But I'm going to go ahead and create, click on where it says Scene Collection. I'm going to hit New, and I'm actually going to name it uh, Vlog uh, in order for it to um, be the assignment that we're doing. Now, when you create your new scene collection, um, you have to add sources to it. So the first source, the easiest source to add, is going to be your video uh, capture device. So the sources uh, menu is here. Sometimes it's located down here, um, but I like to have it over here. So you hit the plus button, and you choose video capture device. And I'm not going to rename it or anything, but if I click OK, what you'll see is my uh, webcam will come up as being the source for this. Um, and that's the one I actually want to use. So I'm going to click OK. Now the next thing that you're going to do is, because this is a video blog, um, you're actually going to expand this to take up the entire t uh, area. And I'm actually pushing the computer uh, where I want it to be so that I'm centered in the shot. So you can see that I'm, there's a tutorial going on uh, in this. The second thing that you have to pick then for your um, source list is something to pick up your audio while you are talking. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to add another audio source and in this case I'm going to pick audio input capture and when I choose this I'm not going to rename it this time but what we're going to pick is the microphone that's in your computer. So if you select that uh, you click OK. Now what you probably notice is on the screen down here, the audio input capture device is actually picking up the audio. Um, it's a fairly reasonable level, although I'm going to turn it down just a little bit. And uh, what happens then is in order for you to create a recording then of your blog, is you simply would click the start recording button right here in the lower right hand corner, and then you you discuss what you want to discuss. So I'm going to go ahead and model this for you. Hello, my name is Mr. Bailey and I teach English 10 and Digital Design at Northside High School. Um, I'm doing a vlog right now about how to do uh, some of the things that we do in this digital design class with regard to using OBS. Um, plus there's some other things that we've done and we're going to do with uh, Adobe Premiere and some audio editing software and the like. Um, so I'm done talking, so I'm going to hit stop recording. So what happens when you hit stop recording is if you go to your videos file, which I have a shortcut on my desktop for the videos file, but you can navigate to it here. Um, what will happen is you'll see that there's an actual video here of what we just um, heard and saw. And in fact, too, uh, what I'm going to do in this one is I'm going to... Uh, play the video and um, you should be able to hear uh, what's going on in the video. So let's go ahead and uh, play the video on the computer. And my computer's thinking very hard. Oh, and I had it muted. some of the things that we do in this digital design class with regard to using OBS. Um, plus, there's some other things that we've done and we're going to do with uh, Adobe Premiere and some audio editing. So you see that that's how you make your vlog. The next thing is, how do you turn it into Schoology? So what you need to do in this case, then, is now that you've got your video file, I'm actually going to click and drag that and put it on my desktop so it's not with all the other video files that I've been creating. Um, and then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use my Google Drive um, in order to um, 
turn this into Schoology. And what you'll essentially do is you'll navigate to a folder that you've chosen. I'm navigating to uh, one that's for digital design. And, and I'm going to create a folder called how to do a vlog, vlogging. And I'll hit create. And I'm going to go ahead and open that. And basically all you have to do is click and drag the video into that Google Drive folder. And you can see that it uploaded. Um, it's running a little slow right now. And then basically what you do is you right click over this and you hit get link. And then you send that link to me in Schoology, and, and then I'll be able to uh, give you a grade for your vlog. But that's how we've been uh, turning things in during the course of the school year. Well, I hope uh, everybody understands what they need to do. Uh, good luck vlogging.